Hey what's up you guys, so today I'll be doing a totally legit review of Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildland. To start this off, I just really want to commend Ubisoft on blending elements from their past games into this one. I know Ubisoft recently has been the king of being repetitive in game design, but I really feel like they hit the nail on the head with this title. If you're coming into this game without playing any other Ghost Recon titles, you won't be lost. Elements like marking enemies instantly draw similarities to games like Far Cry, while performing sync shots is much like modern Splinter Cell titles. This installment takes place in Bolivia, where a drug cartel known as Santa Blanca, led by our main target El Sueño, has taken hold on the government. As the game progressed, I found that there is way more than just bad guys in gun towers. There is an entire army in the hands of El Sueño, and you have only up to yourself and three others to take down that army and save the people of Bolivia. Being as the entire game, you are outmanned and outgunned. It might be a little hard taking out the whole army with you and some compadres, but you find your way. I found that taking out the enemy with stealth is definitely the way to go, as being seen causes fighting that goes one of three ways in Wildlands. Live, run, or die. First couple hours, especially if playing on console, you'll be doing a lot of option 2 and 3. You want to avoid being picked up by your three amigos every two seconds, you're going to want to invest in some drone upgrades and bullet resistance. With the drone, not only are you able to see Tom over there scratching his ass, you can go full on predator mode and strap thermals to both it and yourself. Run! Go! Get to the chopper! Target set, ready to assault. Oh my god, ghost. 